Well, there were a lot of changes for Aggie football fans at Kyle Field Saturday, but one outside the stadium made game day even more better for fans. And the Texas A&M Transportation Institute continued meetings today to tweak their traffic plan that went into effect Saturday both before and after that game. KAG's HD News reporter Chris Costa shows us why this first home game was a good test run for future games. It was the largest crowd ever. 105,000 screaming fans packed Kyle Field Saturday. Then they had to get home. Hunter Roan was one of many fans who left the game early. Even though we did leave early, it was still there was still more traffic. But on the way here, it wasn't a big deal getting here. Some left during the lightning delay when the team had to go back inside after warm-ups. Others left after halftime after the Aggies chalked up 31 points to Lamar's three. The Texas A&M Transportation Institute says a mass exit will be a bigger challenge. It clearly wasn't as big a stress as we're going to have, say, for the Ole Miss game or the LSU game later on. It's a nice test. We think we've got some things that we learned and we're going to implement some changes. College Station police say even with almost 105,000 fans inside Kyle Field on Saturday, many of them left gradually, leaving typically congested streets like George Bush Drive pretty easy going for traffic. During the season, we tend to become more efficient. The public becomes, they become used to the expectations. And as we grow through that process, things tend to go smoother uh, with each subsequent week. TTI says they plan to add more police officers at intersections like FM 2818 and Holloman Drive to make it easier for drivers. All welcomed additions for fans like Hunter who just want to get home after the game. I'm sure it'll get better as the season goes on and that's like the hopeful, hopeful thing because nobody wants to sit in traffic. Whether they're going to or coming from the stadium. In College Station, Chris Costa, KAGS HD News. And the TTI says they will continue to evolve the traffic plan as they learn more from each home game. They also encourage fans to download the Destination Aggieland app to streamline their parking and experience at Kyle Field.